Do you want to know how to turn old patients into new bookings fast? Let's do this. But before we do, I'm Tristan Bond, CEO of Practice Acceleration. And what we do is help great healthcare professionals to create thriving businesses with an emphasis on building a business that does not depend on them. Reactivating the patients you already have is easily the fastest driver of growth and revenue in your practice. Here's why. Now, attracting and converting new leads into patients within your practice, it takes time, it takes effort, it takes money, all whilst your past patients are already there. They're in your database right now. Plus, they are six times more likely to do business with you because you've already established this relationship of no like and trust and value. Now, that being said, there is a right way and a very wrong way to actually communicate with your past patients and to bring them back in again and again. So today, I'm gonna to share with you the fastest and the best way to do this properly, so stick around. So successfully reactivating past patients all comes down to user experience. And by that, here's what I mean. How your past patients will actually be consuming your information and your communication, your messages. Now, a major factor in successful marketing and something that many marketers and business owners overlook is to take into consideration the actual platform that you're using to communicate and convey your message. Now, while most people are really focused on what to say, or perhaps they're even worrying about whether they should be contacting people in their database in the first place because they're worried about bothering them, they're actually missing the single most important factor when it comes to reactivating their list. When you get the user experience wrong, then chances are your past patients will respond very negatively to you when you send out your message to them. Now that is exactly not what we want. So you need to consider how people are feeling when they're receiving your message and how to make your message not another annoying interruption, but instead something very helpful and useful to them. This is what makes all the difference. And it all depends on the platform that you use to communicate with them on. And do you know what the best platform to communicate with your audience is? Well, the best platform to do this on is text message. Why is that? Well, if you think about it, nobody answers phone calls from numbers they don't recognize anymore. Look, I don't even take calls from people that I know, to be honest. Perhaps you're the same. And emails, they tend to hit the spam folder or they can sit there for weeks before being checked. And who takes notice of any snail mail anymore? Nobody. But everybody checks their text messages almost immediately. But here's why it's just so important to consider the user experience when marketing in this way. So pay attention. Now think very carefully about the mood that people are in when they're checking their text messages. They're feeling this little zing of dopamine because they're expecting a message from a friend. So if you send them an impersonal, overly marketing or salesy type message, they're going to be put off. Maybe they'll even respond back negatively asking you not to contact them again. You do not want that. The way to make this strategy really work for you is to make sure that your message feels like it's from a friend. So make it short, make it friendly, and make it personal. And above all else, do not push a sale onto them. Keep it very casual. Our Practice Machine coaching members use our done-for-you text message scripts to start casual conversations with their database that lead to future bookings because they raise their hand up and they're actually asking for an appointment. We might say something casual like, hey, it's been a while since you last saw us. How are you getting along with your headaches? Or, hey, I just wanted to touch base and see how you're doing. Is there anything we can do to help you right now? It is so casual, it is friendly, it is valuable. By using an open-ended question, you are triggering them to reply. And that's the whole point here. The whole purpose of the text message is to start a conversation, to show genuine interest and care, and to re-establish that relationship where they know, like, and trust you. You'll be so surprised at how well this works when you do it right. Our practice machine members typically get 
20 to 40 replies within just minutes of using our pre-written scripts. And they end up booking at least 20% of those people back into their clinic, resulting in thousands of dollars of bookings for basically zero spend. Plus it's literally the fastest, easiest way that we found to spark a flood of new patients to your practice within just a couple of hours. Hey, you know what? If you wanna roll this strategy out for yourself, I strongly recommend and encourage you to check out my five minute patient reactivation system. It contains step-by-step -step instructions and pre-written scripts for reactivating past patients and bringing them back into your practice. The system is so easy to set up and use. In fact, it only takes five minutes to deploy. It is my gift to you for free for watching. I'm gonna pop a link in here below. That way you can access it for free. Just follow the system step by step and you will see the results for yourself. So go and do that now. And of course, once again, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you on the other side.